yeah, yeah. Back once again. Another night of playoffs. Another wild night of playoffs. Thanks to Draymond Green. It's a bonus. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think they should have gave Draymond Green a flagrant two. I should have. They should have gave him a flagrant one, just like they gave Sabonis a flagrant one. I think they both did pretty much the same thing, except for Sabonis sold his more. And major props to Sabonis too. When you're playing against a player like a Draymond Green, a Chris Paul. Bruce Bowen. Uh, it's a it's a certain a uh, Dennis Rodman. It's a certain defensive player, offensive player where they more tricky with the dirty plays, and they can get away with it most of the games. And but for Sabonis to go in the trenches with Draymond Green and play dirty with him and win the dirty fight that's that's a scary situation for the whole nba because not only are the kings talented they got the heart you can't shake them and you can't break them so they young fresher legs than you just as talented as you and they got the heart to it they not scared the, the Sacramento Kings are looking serious. When it comes to the Brooklyn Nets and 76ers and the Nuggets and Timberwolves, those are the matchups where it's like kind of boring. You know who's going to win, kind of prolonging what's going to happen anyway. The 76ers should advance. The Nuggets should advance. Listen, the Nuggets beat the Timberwolves and Joker only had 13 points, man. <laughs> so realistically, it's only the Warriors and Sacramento Kings and the Clippers and the Suns are the most kind of real competitive, give you a good playoff feel of basketball. Boston is gonna <laughs> it's gonna beat them. 76ers. It's kind of like, uh, who the Heat playing against? The Heat. Oh, the Heat and the Bucks. That when Giannis get back, hopefully he don't be out no more than this next game and be back game three. Because if he out this game and they lose and they down 2-0, and the way Jimmy Butler turned it on in the playoffs, where he just becomes this elite top ten player in the playoffs. Good luck. Good luck. But right, right now, the best playoff series is easily the Warriors and the Kings. Looking forward to those games the most.